Achieving a soft focused image where the middle of the shot is pin sharp and the outer edges are blurred can be achieved easily by loading up the edges of a lens with petroleum jelly. It's an old technique, but a good one, and still employed even with today's modern high resolution digital cameras. Blur the edges of the frame and the viewer will have no choice but to look directly at your focal point. Now it's not wise to smear the Vaseline directly onto pricey optics, so instead you're going to need a cheap UV filter to attach and smear it on instead. To find out which size filter will fit your lens, look on the lens barrel or inside the lens cap. On this kit lens we can see it's 58mm. We got our hands on a 58mm UV filter from SRB Photographic, which cost just £14.50 and fit the Canon 18-55 to that we used absolutely perfectly. With the right UV filter to hand, it's time to screw it onto the front filter thread of your lens, though if you see any dust on the filter or lens, it's best to blast this off beforehand. Now apply a donut shaped layer of Vaseline around the edge of the filter, ensuring the centre remains untouched, as you want this area to be pin sharp. Start off with a small layer, you can always add more as you go to build up the effect. Now place your active AF point over the part of the image you want to focus on, such as the building in our shot. Then half press the shutter to focus and switch over to manual focus to lock it in place. Now you can take your shot and decide if more or less petroleum jelly is required. Go into your Canon camera's aperture priority or AV mode and dial in an ISO of 100 for the best image quality and an aperture of your choosing, but bear in mind that a wider aperture will give you more blur. Then set up on a tripod and activate the 2 second self timer mode to avoid camera shake. When you're all finished taking your blurry images you'll need to clean the filter before putting it back in your kit bag as you don't want this getting all over the place. So wipe it off with an old microfiber cloth and use some glass cleaner to make sure all of the residue is removed. So it's as easy as that to replicate the soft focus effects of old lenses with this brilliantly simple hack. Try it out for yourselves now.